guys and welcome back to this channel. First thing first, I have some really exciting news to share with you and that is I am now part of the ambassador team for Daily Charm. And that means new discount code for you guys. So if you use the code CASEPOLISH, you'll save 10% off your next Daily Charm order. To celebrate that, we have this huge Daily Charm fall haul and we are going to jump in right away. The first thing which I'm super curious to try out is their Lit Mini. It is a rechargeable UV LED mini lamp, so it is cord free, which is amazing. And it comes beautifully packed in this cute little box. You have your little instruction booklet, very important. The USB cord to charge it and I imagine this must be the piece to plug it in the wall. Yep, that's it. Even this is cute. It has like a pearly finish. I like it already before even seeing the lamp. So the lamp is in here, all well protected. Look at how sleek. And you get just the right space to cure one nail. You have your on off button. The little lights here indicate the battery level. And your main touch button to start or stop the light. And if you press it longer, it'll switch the lamp between a 30 second cure and a 60 second cure. This is what it looks like when you turn it on. Please note that prior to using your lamp, you need to give it a 6 hour charge. I did have to stop filming and continue the next day for that purpose, so I did not use it straight out of the box like it may seem here. I did this because we're gonna put it to the test in a couple minutes. Up next, we have four of their super sparkly glitter dusts. The first one is this gorgeous holographic red called Lucius Red. Unfortunately, the camera does not quite catch how holographic this is. Then we have this pretty holographic blue called Galactic Blue. It is super pretty and would make for beautiful icy themed nails. To continue with the bigger ones, starting with Royal Blue, which is one of their metallic glitter dusts. Of course, this had to happen. I made a mess again. I shouldn't be allowed around glitter, but they're so pretty. And then we have this beautiful, beautiful holographic gold called Celestial Gold. Would you look at that? It almost looks like real gold. And now let's have a look at these beautiful transfer foils. The first one is Aurora Opal. It is this clear iridescent one and I can't wait to start playing with it. Then we have Dreamy Watercolor and this is totally my type of shade. Next one is a deep blue with gold drops called Starry Lapis. The 
to continue with this gorgeous marble one called pastel blue marble and the last one but not the least rainbow sea foam i think this one could be super versatile and gives you tons of different effects depending on which part of it you use. For example, this part right here makes me think of spooky trees. Perfect for Halloween. Then we have a bunch of new butterfly stickers. The first one is their holographic butterfly nail art sticker in Pastel Dream. in le papillon, which means the butterfly in French. And in kaleidoscope. To continue with their trendy butterfly nail art sticker in exotic, which has both colorful and neutral colored butterflies. next one here is the tropical one, which is the most colorful of them all. And the last one, and probably my favorite one, the vintage one. All soft blues and browns, perfect fall colors. That being said, I have never worked with nail stickers and I can't wait to try it out. Next up, crystals and paper glitters. First, the Swarovski packs, which, you know, never disappoint. The first one is their Halloween value mix, which has a bunch of oranges, purples, and greens. Absolutely perfect for Halloween. They really, really created a nice pack for the occasion. Then, with more fall neutral tones, this is their Enchanted Autumn value mix. They also included these cute gold heart studs. Now onto the soft paper glitters. I have never seen something quite like this before, so I think it's pretty fun. They're like tiny confettis that you can add to your nail designs. The first one is their Friendly Monsters pack, which has little vampires, ghosts, Frankensteins, little black cats, mummies, Then we have the Purple Treats pack. This one is of course purple themed with little candies, ghosts, cats, and little happy Halloween pumpkins. And the last one is the Trick or Treats pack. This one is more on the orange side with little pumpkins, cats, hats, bats, and little owls. Now onto the next part, which you already know I love, the charm gels. And this time we have their new jellies and we're also gonna put to the test our brand new and fully charged lip mini that I showed you earlier. For that purpose, I already prepared my swatch sticks, so let's jump in. Our first shade is one I'm super pumped about. This is J02 Milk Bath. It is this milky white tone, as its name says it. This is the one you'd want to use for your classic milk bath nails. But I personally think it could look beautiful on its own as well. And hop in our lit mini for one minute. Charm Gel's instructions say 30 seconds to a minute, but I tend to always go for the longest of both. I also like to top everything with their diamond shine top coat. Then we have J03 Garden Rose. Mm. 
Ooh, this is such a cute baby pink. And I love that these jelly gels have the perfect level of sheer for, let's say, French manicures, but they're also buildable enough to get full coverage within two to three coats. Up next, J04 Macaroon. This one is a deep blush pink, almost like a classic bubblegum color. Then comes J05 Dulcet. It is a beautiful peachy nude, a little bit more on the blush pink side, but really a pretty color. Here we have J06 Frenchy. The perfect light nude shade. To finish with a J07 Coffee House. This is another pretty nude, a tiny bit more on the brown side this time. And here are our new colors next to each other. As always, same amazing, smooth, high quality formula. I'm impressed every single time. So that is it for this huge daily charm haul packed with amazing products. I have so many ideas of tutorials, I just don't know where to start. So definitely comment below and let me know what you'd like to see in action first. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already so you don't miss any of the upcoming videos and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!